Hello everyone, welcome back to episode 21 of We Happy Few, where we explore the, um, what was it again, the executive offices. So, also the quarantine, That's and I really the hope... Grid. Oh, I hope I don't regret this. Yeah, me too. Oh no, I think this is where the really tough stuff is happening. Um... Attention all staff. A downer with plague has escaped from the test labs. Please consider him armed and dangerous. Be on your guard. Oh wow, this sounds safe. First thing we hear is that a downer escapes here. <sighs> I really hope that we find Gemma and that we can get her out safe. Oh wow. Ah, there you are. <gasps> We've been waiting for you. Oh no. How long until the coconut joy takes effect? There we go. Lovely. Oh. Now, Dr. Brooks is going to bring in a series oh, of disturbing stimuli. Not again. Hopefully, with the coconut joy I've given you, you won't be a bit bothered. We oh, won't no. actually see the stimuli. There's a blind between us and you. And a blind between you and the stimuli. It's what we call a double blind experiment. Off you go. Don't forget to write. <laughs> That's my little joke. I know you've forgotten how to write. What? is happening here. <laughs> Where is this weird music coming from? Or is this because... Is this because we're... Because we're on a memory loss episode, that we are hearing no strange music. That is so awkward. I think this is. But I think this is it. This is where we got caught. So let's. Let's see what I can do to this with my trusty Framistat. Ooh. Let's go. Now everything's better under the sun. Dark in the dark. 
I don't really want to talk anything because I just want to listen to the music, but how are we going to get out here? ending is this the end did we do it did we can we go now and can we go now and find Percy will we find Percy though Oh, so now we have to go to the broadcast tower. <sighs> oh well, is this really it? Did we do it? Sounds just too good to be true. I'm sorry, sir. The broadcast tower has been quarantined. Well, I think if you examine the gate, you'll see that it's been unquarantined. Oh, so it has. Well then, I'll just bugger off, shan't I? <laughs> Enjoy your visit. That was easy. home station we did it we actually did it that's the lovely thing about English weather the sun always comes out in the end so come on out took a v-meat sandwich off a downer this morning Ooh. how on earth did a diner get v-meat I haven't the foggiest but I'll tell you it was the best meal I've had in days I'd imagine so there's still police down here, but... Oh. While the service entrance is out of order, workers may use this entrance, but proper decorum is required at all times. Please ensure that your boots do not drip, as we have recently had the carpet cleaned again, the management. Hmm. I think we made it. You can finally escape to the mainland. Are you ready? Once you go through these doors, Arthur will be done with any other adventures in Wellington Wells. Wow. This is definitely it. Oh, wow. So... Hmm. That's a good question. Do we actually want to finish this right now? 
Or do we want to do some more side quests? I mean, there aren't a lot that we still have open. Except for, still, the Church of Simon says it would have been nice. It would have been nice to find out what that was all about. But it's also been nice to disable Nick's security. I don't know. This one has, I don't know, I'm not really sure. This is just um, a hint to where we can find Motaline. This would have also been an interesting quest. So... What's this about? Power the downer detector and find a way into Colonel Lawrence's house. Hmm. I'm torn. On the one hand, this is like the flow of the story. So Arthur wouldn't go back now to do some stupid side quest. On the other hand, I would really like to, to find out more. I don't know, maybe there's more memories to collect, maybe there's more um, things to collect, maybe there's more documents or whatever, but I don't know, I'm torn. I would also I would only play it for the story because definitely it definitely wouldn't be for the loot because I think we're very well equipped now. I mean we managed to beat the game, actually. Maybe what I'm going to do is I will use this episode to I don't know, just visit some of the other quests and of course I'm going to cut out the path in between and all, but I don't know, it would be too bad because, especially with this whole Nick Lightbearer mission, I was always saying that maybe we should come back later another time so maybe we have the right gadgets to get past Nick's security and all. So I definitely want to bring this to a finish because our, those two quests are connected. So if we finally disable Nick's security, I think we would be able to go to this church of Simon Says. No, let's just go with it. So in the end of this episode, we will finish this. But first, I want to take care of some stuff. I want to find out a little more. So where do we have to go? So this is where Nick Lightbearer. So this is the Nick Lightbearer quest. And we are going to go here. Okay, so we're in again and I'm telling you this quest is still climbing all this way up to the stupid home of Nick Lightbearer is still annoying. Now I'm gonna go trigger this alarm again. I'm gonna farm no! <clears throat> Leave me alone for a sec. You'd almost so. think he doesn't like unannounced visitors. Okay. Talk to Nick? What? He's here? He's here? Oh! Oh well. Heavens! What's that smell? Like rancid cat with an overlay of. Well, he's been smoking something, hasn't he? Oh no, I hope he's not dead. Oh, who are you? Who are you? Yeah, I wonder the same thing. Who are you? Are you Mrs. Lightbearer or, or something? So. You sitting again? But hmm, I want to know what's happening in this room. So Did you hear something? Go look over there. What was that? Go over there. Is someone yes. there? Yes. No one's here. Well, I think he's having the life of a rock star. Um, what's this? Oh yes, 
combo to next save. Very good. Eat it after you memorize it. Oh, I don't think I want to do that. Remember, number of times Edie and I shagged. God, I miss Edie. Number of gold records, number of songs that weren't total rubbish. 11.26.4. Okay. I hope I don't have to remember this, but okay. Let's go up here. We already know where the safe is. What's this? Okay, we're going to take this with us. Some new notes. Some mushrooms, some vomit bombs. No, I don't want that. I'll take the short spike. So, okay, we have a dick spot. Lost lyrics. Dream song. I dreamed I was a golden god, my altar on a train. I could have gone around the world and brought that train back home again. Where do you travel? Where do you go? Your golden god, he wants to know. Where do you travel? Where do you go? Your golden brother misses you so. Fuck no, are you joking? Special Sally. Special Sally brings me candy. Put the candy in me handy. So Sally specials make my day. Sally hasn't come today. Has special Sally gone away? Oh, this is like a real tongue breaker. I don't know if this is an English word. Come back Sally, make my day. Come back Sally, make my day. Come back Sally, come and play. Special Sally, hey hey hey. Where the fuck is special Sally? Little Nicky needs his sweets. Sally specials make my day. Yeah, that'll go over great at the Deaf Institute. Next diary. Blue ovals. Everything seems... What do the French call the shit wine you still drink? Bouvable. It all lacks a certain je ne sais quoi. Everything lacks a je ne sais quoi. I wish I knew what it was. I think Stuart gave me someone else's prescription. Someone who needs to calm down, I'd guess. Green capsules. I see London, I see France. I love my favorite underpants. Woo, dizzy. Little gelatin pyramids. Many are my names. I'll speak in tongues and all shall fear. Up and down the world I'll walk. I am the light, I am the light. Headache like, headache like a beast afterwards. Wish I had biscuits. Red blotting paper. Plus paracetamol. I can't shake the feeling that I'm just a character in someone's story and someone's already decided how it's all going to end. But it's not the real end. I'm just going to keep going around. So long as I keep telling that story, I'm doomed to go round and round again. Probably dying the exact same way every time. No wonder the greatest achievement for the Hindus is to get off the wheel. Do I even have real fans? Have I ever seen them? How do I know they're real? What if my memory isn't real? I can't make out their faces, or I can, but all their faces are the same. Like there's one girl face and one boy face, they even move the same way. I think therefore I am, but do I really think? Or am I just saying that? Huh. So I guess Nick was taking some different drugs there. <laughs> this one's a little bit breaking the fourth wall. So, red and green caps. Grey, grey, go away, the smell of ashes and dead rain. I want my money back. Rocket, I'm flying, I can't go anywhere. Jesus, I could kiss that girl, she's a fucking genius. Blast off. Great name, but it's bollocks. Tastes like joy. I think the wanger just emptied out some joys and squirted colored water inside. I've had farts more enlightened than these. I've got to go visit the interplanetary travel agency, but that would mean going outside. I'm not sure I'm up to that. Fuck, where is she? Why doesn't she make house calls anymore? So, Rocket... Um, is this the same thing that Sally gave to us? Is this one that makes you look like you're on joy, but you're actually not? Because, I mean, he could go anywhere with it. So... No, no one has died. Oh, this is Nick. Mr. Lightbearer? Duck! Sorry. The very large bats. No? Listen, they're waiting for you. Down at the church. You got any bennies? Bufos? Well, come on, man. You didn't bring an offering? I am the Lord thy God. Dizzy. Why don't we drink some tea? Oh, and uh, how about a uh, nice cold bath? A bath? Yeah. I was going to have a bath. I wouldn't be so sure about that. I'm sure he's drowning. Oh, well. Um. So. 
fraud. One day they'll drop you like a downer into the river. Probably if you become a downer. So, no, I'm not gonna rate this house, I guess. I'm just looking for documents. So, Peter. No, I'll take that. <laughs> so, what's in here? Ah, it's jammed. Okay, then let's talk him out of there. Hello? Oh no, I'm sure he electrocuted the fans himself. forget, man. They forget. And this is why we mustn't disappoint them. I used to be bottled power, man. Oh god, the power cell. I'm not gonna drink it. I learned that lesson. No, no, no. no. Oh god. Hello? <laughs> hmm. Brilliant. I think I knew oh, it. Gonna call Simon says. Well, hmm. apparently we are. I guess. Are you pondering what I'm pondering? Definitely. This is what I was pondering all the time. Before. Oh wait, just key. Yes. Next panic room key card. Yeah. Well, we already opened that. I'm sorry, Nick. Well, I kind of said so that he would be that he was electrocute himself hmm well that's too bad so now we can take his glad rex on your way yeah on my way because now I need to get back there so, oh no, whoops, oh well, whatever. So, one quest complete and now we are gonna go and bring the Glidebearer to the church, which will be us. So, I'll be back again soon. Although, maybe, yeah, I think I'm gonna go and take this motelin spell or spill or whatever it is so will people be more relaxed if i take no not those racks the working clothes if i put on my working clothes it smells like something there. burned out so i can harvest the motelin and now the quest should be done bingo Quest complete. So now I'm gonna put on. Oh well, I'm gonna put on my fabulous clothes again. Okay, and next will be Church of Simon Says again. Although, what I really have to say is, I don't know what will happen if we really pass this train station and if we really go there and finish the game. Will there be some. I don't know, some explanation for dummies like me, because I'm still a little bit clueless about the story. I mean, are we Percy now? Are we Arthur? Oh, what really happened with Sally? I don't know. I would really like to know the whole story. I would like to know it from the game. I think we need to change. Next glad racks. They look the same as ours do, but okay. I think now we have to take some joy. After we had some memory loss, uh, I guess well, we can start anew. Entirely too good. Hello. Goodness, Mr. Lightbearer, is that you? Of course yeah, it is. Yeah, baby, I'm the Lightbearer. Love me. Good have acting. You getting enough to eat? You look. Thinner than in your pictures. Yeah, we, we don't really need food, did you know? It's just an illusion. If you think about it hard enough, it's ridiculous. It's so animal. We're higher than that, you know? But you have to eat, don't you? Music is my food, baby. I live off the vibrations. You just have to tune in and you can live forever. Shit, I should have asked for cookies. Well, we so did it. Happy to have you here at Saint Genesius. Did you know he's the patron saint of epileptics? The church huh. isn't nearly as old as it looks. 
We had some rebuilding to do after the bombings. Oh, <laughs> sometimes I forget where to stop history and just jump ahead to the present. And that's our organist, Mr Shrapnel. Did you know he's deaf? But Beethoven was too in the end. Oh, look at those lovely prizes. With that medal, you'll look as shiny as a brand new penny. We've got quite a crowd today. I don't know why they dress like that. What do they do if it itches? Looking good. You love me. Ladies and gentlemen, we are so grateful to be able to present to you our celebrity caller, the famous singer, Mr. Nicholas Lightbear. I am a golden calf! Love me, babies! I live on your love! Live my love, babies! Are you ready to follow instructions? OK. Now, if I say Simon says do something, then you have to do it or you're out. But if I don't say Simon says and you do it, you're out. Oh, and you get zapped. Uh, that's right, and you get zapped. Are you ready, Hamlin Village? Is that it? Isn't that why you're wearing those rubber cat suits? So... Simon says, World Smallest Race Trend. Monopod! Damn that good! I am your god! I've got to be clever somehow. Simon says... Helicopter! <laughs> Simon says... It's still there? I've got to mold them into a full sense of Simon Says. Simon Says! Twist in the wind! <laughs> Simon Says! Bow down to me! Simon Says! You stepped on a nail! Simon Says! It's all around you! Simon says, who's a good dog? Simon says, scratch your foot. Simon says, slap your face. Okay, let's try it. Aha! You people have listen! You people are enjoying losing a bit too much, you know what I mean? <laughs> Simon says, do the twist. I think now I'm glad that we did this episode, that we did this, Simon um, not says, episode, but we did this side quest. This is, kind of, this is kind of fun. Simon says, one hand clapping. Oh well, that lady is still enjoying herself. Aha! Uh -huh. Gotcha! You people are enjoying losing a bit too much, you know what I mean? Simon says... Go nowhere fast! <laughs> Simon says... Which way are you going? It's still there? These guys are good. I'm gonna have to get into a rhythm and then trip them. Yeah, I guess. These guys are really good. Monopod! Simon says... Twist in the wind! Simon says... Show me your love! <laughs> Simon says... I gotta say, I'm enjoying myself almost as much as the Jubilator ride right now. Simon says, do the twist. 
Okay, one more Simon says, and then we're going to trick them again. <laughs> oh well, just slap yourself now. Ah, there you go. Arthur is actually thriving in the role of Nick Nightbearer. Simon says. Okay, now we're gonna slap ourselves. <laughs> Simon says. Throw you back out. Simon says. Which way are you going? Simon says. Who's a good dog? Those pets look really brutal. Simon says. Okay, let's do it again. Run in place. Aha! Gotcha. Bye. Okay, three more to go. Simon says, do the twist. Okay. Simon says. Slap your face. They're going all in with those slaps. Simon says it's all around you. Simon says world's smallest race trend. Keep your hair on. Aha! Uh -huh. I didn't say Simon says. Okay, good rounds, two outs. It's not supposed to spark like that. Oh. Oh no. Whoops! God, oh my god. They're ashes. It's not touching the ones on the floor. How do I get out of here though? I've got to turn it off somehow. Maybe I can turn it off. There must be a switch. Oh well. I think they are too good at Simon Says. So there's not a switch here, is it? There are... These cables lead to nowhere. What? This is awkward. No, I don't have to. Oh. Oh, okay, so I'm just leaving now. Well. Goodbye! But how am I going to escape? Can I climb the fence? No. Can I climb <sighs> gravestone and then the fence? No. So, wait. Okay, so I have to get out there in front. What's the what was this about a switch? Oh well no, I'm just gonna just gonna make a run. Oh wait. Do join us for tea and biscuits as we bid farewell to our vicar, who has gone on holiday in anticipation of his retirement. When the Sunday, right after Simon says, where the Church of St. Genesius, no RSVP necessary. Okay, run! Okay. Deactivate the electricity. So what's here? Sovereign. Oh, it's another memory here. Oh well, I don't need this. Let's go. Well, Dad wants to know if he can come in the bedroom. Okay. Are you wearing clothes? Yes. Percy, just a shirt is not clothes. So, it seems there's a pattern here that Percy all didn't really give too much care to his clothes. Oh, well, hello there. You can take your no! I'm okay, I'm okay. Hmm. Okay, so... You can take your Ouch! What? How did this reach me? 
Okay, no, just gonna use. Just gonna turn off the electricity first. Now, where did they say that metal was? Well, in that case, I guess. Oh no, Mr. Shrapnel, I'm not gonna search you. So sorry that you died. How long are they gonna lie there like that? I'm wondering too. Oh well. So... I wonder, can I fast travel now? From the doorstep? Wait a second. What quest? Oh yeah, that's the treehouse quest. Hmm. So. Now, we have finished all the quests on Maidenholm, I think. I don't really care about the mysterious chest right now, so the next one would be Lot's Home, the treehouse. Although, I don't know. Do I really want to do this? I'm not really that much interested in that because, I don't know, a puppet theater? Maybe we would meet someone interesting there, but I'm not so sure. Oh well. Let's just spend some of our last earned skill points. So we probably won't need them that much. Okay, I think I'm gonna le let go of Treehouse. Um, well, maybe, maybe in some of the parts with this downer detector, hmm, maybe there's something good happening. Well, not maybe not something good, but maybe there's something interesting in there. I don't know. I like this church quest very much now. Um, it was enjoyable. It was very fun. It took a long time though to you know get them. Mm, to make their mistakes but it was also nice because we found another memory although at this mo at this point i don't really think that those memories would give so much um infos about the story i think it's just memories from their childhood okay so we're just gonna go to the sum of the parts now okay here we are let's put in the power cell Oof. So I guess I need to take another joy now. Well. We're life for noise. Pop a joy. I need to search for what? Search for an old impounded car. Okay. Well, apparently I have a key card for this. It's good to know. So let's just arm those traps first. Hmm, is there anything worth taking? Oh, I can press the button too. Whatever this just did. Oh, it's a worker's key card. Also useful. No. What? Oops. Oh well. Oh well, stop laughing. I don't have anything to laugh soon. Yeah. Can't we work something out? No. I guess not. So... Okay, so we didn't have... We didn't find everything, I guess. Well, I do have to press that. Oh, maybe it closes after some time. <laughs> We're running really funny. Oh, hello there. Nope. Oi! Get out of there! Okay, so he the spankers! Reverse the pillar, reverse! <laughs> okay. That also went well. Huh. Okay. Oh, 
Okay, so what do we find here? Do we need to open the trunk? Oh. Okay, so this was just another looting mission. Oh, whoops. Are you feeling alright, sir? Nope. <laughs> well, he was motivated. Fine. <laughs> Yes. So, what's next? Ah, okay, so this is how I get out again. Very good. Okay. Another quest complete. So, now... Um, yeah. Why is it always starting down here? Hmm. Thinking about following this, and this will be the last quest we're doing. I think the curfew should start soon, so... Just, uh... I'm just gonna relax the day go for by. a bit. And then... I will see you at the colonel's house. Okay, so here we are. So, the first time we've been here, we weren't able to oh, enter. I wouldn't mind having a couple with some of those jellies. Man to man, they're decent, clean folk. I don't really understand how we should get in there, because we can't climb this window, can we? I'm going to make officer. You'll see. I can't really... I, I don't really know how to get into there. Because we can't open these windows. There's the back door. Maybe we can enter from the other side of the block? Hmm. Maybe there's some backyard or something? I mean, this is a huge... A big block, so I don't know if we can just. No! No, there's not really anything that. Okay, so to be honest, I I don't know. I think that this would only be a looting quest anyway, so. <sighs> Let's finish this. Let's get Arthur out of Wellington Wells. Then we did it. Clever of them to pave the tracks with good intentions. So, there's a lot that we didn't, I don't know, solve, I guess. We weren't able to save Gemma. I mean, we didn't see her when we were in this institute. That's too bad. I'm really sorry for that. I don't know if we could have changed that. So, hmm. Oh well. Hmm. Pace yourself, Arthur. And also, I mean, the future of Wellington Wells looks really grim. To be honest, I mean, they will all try to lobotomize um, all the citizens. I can't keep doing this. More people will go crazy because of a bad batch of joy. I'm really... I don't know. It's really sad to go. Hello. That's my old office. I bet Clive got my window, didn't he? The little shit. <laughs> oh. Probably he did. Oh well, so this is where Arthur used to work. So is this the, oh yeah, Department of Archives Printing and Recycling. Yeah, that's our old workplace. He must have had a nice view. No wonder Clive wanted to offer the, the window office. Oh well. So I don't know. Those side quests that we just did, I mean yeah. They were okay. So can I just 
Okay. Sorry, sir. The broadcast tower has been quarantined. Well, I think if you examine the gate, you'll see that it's been unquarantined. Oh, so it has. Well then, I'll just bugger off, shan't I? <laughs> Enjoy your visit. Thanks. Oh well, so that was a little bit of a trip down memory lane. I mean, we revisited Maiden Home, or I think we spent a lot of time. And I don't know. So, yeah. It was nice. I suppose it would be lovely to visit the old broadcast tower, but I do sort of need to get the hell out of Wellington Wells. Yeah, I've got that's to go true. I just Turn wanted to see again. if there's something else so up come there. On out. Took a V meat sandwich off a downer this morning. Are they talking always about the same now stuff? I, I don't know. Again. So, oh no! Hey, I want to go. Yeah. Okay, they're gone. So, that's it. Arthur made it. We made it. So, goodbye, Arthur. I hope you find Percy. I mean, will it be over now? Oh, it's not over. Yeah. Will it be over now? I think the rail tracks are just past those revolvers. Oh, no. Okay. Um, so... They really don't want anyone down here, do they? Ah, oh, we have to pop another joy, don't we? Oh well, I really don't want to have any trouble now. I can take this now. all the time, and I wouldn't have any worries. I don't really want to have any more trouble down here now. What? No! 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 Oh no! So, I don't know, it seems like we won't be able to get out of here again, so will we die now? No, please no. It would be so sad if Arthur wouldn't make it. Also, what I find really sad is that we didn't find out anything more about Prudence, if Prudence made it or not. Although maybe it's not over yet. Oh no. Okay, I think it's time that we get out. Oh! So, I guess... Find a way across the block. Okay. What's this? Raw materials exchanged for manufactured ones. Uh, no, oh, whatever. Skipper luggage delivered to Haverth Labs. Get your goods up front, the entire city has gone mad. So... What's happening here? Lava lamps, good condition, what will you trade for them? What the fuck is a lava lamp? Hmm. So, who is saying this to you soon? floor's collapsed. So much for the tracks. Oh, I hope I don't have to go up there. Oh well. I'm afraid we do have to go up there. Well, if I hadn't known that this would have been so much more of a climb now. I'm gonna have to go up there, aren't I? Oof. Oh well. I'm sorry, Arthur. Nothing's ever easy for you, is it? So, where am I going to now? Maybe here. Hmm. Why does God hate me? I don't know. No, no, no! Oh! Woo. I think the game saved me here because I'm sure I wouldn't have made that jump. So, if we go down there, I hope that there are some switches where we can turn off electricity. Right. Yeah, that's a switch. Very good. <sighs> okay, now that's done. Mm, wrong button. So, now the electricity is off, and now we can jump this other. Okay. <laughs> so. 
So let's do this one more time. No. No! No, 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 no. Oh, crap. Oh no, this doesn't look good. Ah, everything's shaking. Okay. So maybe there will be some final memory where we really get our memory back, how it really was. So what really happened? Whoa! Okay, definitely. Put gas mask on before taking joy. There's so much. Yeah, I guess we need to put on a gas mask. Sorry, Nick. Ah, well, let's just fit in a little bit better. Breathe in those fumes. No, I guess not. Do not take other people's gas masks. You know who you are. Okay. Do we need to go down there? Oh yeah, that's a vent. Ugh. Mm-hmm. Okay, um, I can't see anything. Oh, well, here. Here we are. Well, yes. Looks like I wasn't the first one here. Oh, no. Is that prudence? Oh, shit. Oh, that's prudence. prudence. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, that's too far. Oh, no, it's prudence. No. Oh, no. I so hope that she would have made it. Although, I feared that it would be and that it would be like this. Oh, wow. Well, we are not in a train station anymore. There are people here. Oops. Sorry, mustache. Did you hear about Constable Rosetti's wife's cake? I did not. Why is everyone talking about that? Still, even down here. Oh well. Oof. Things are never easy for Arthur, it seems. I hope I can get back to the tracks through the mines somehow. What's this? Well, it looks like someone tried to jab some lockpicks into there. Okay, where do we go here? Hmm. <laughs> so, now this is an elevator or something? Okay, I hope that this will bring us to where we want to go. I do not have the biggest trust. Oh no. Oops. I'm sure it's perfectly safe going into the mines. What are the odds they'll collapse again, eh? Uh huh. Oh, we need to go down there. God, it does look like a camel. Oh. Hello. Do I know you? The uh, executive committee asked me to see how things are going down here. About bloody time. I've been asking them for months. They think everything's peachy keen down here. It's not peachy keen, is it? I don't suppose you saw anyone working? 
on the way in? Unless they were disguising it terribly well, no. They get dirty if they forget to go topside. The XCOM sent me to inspect the... the machine over there. The bucket wheel excavator? <laughs> oh, this is hilarious. Did you happen to notice a bloody great hole on your way in? That's because we delved too sloppily and too deep with that thing, and half the mine collapsed. I told the gang to stick to picks and shovels. If we start that beast up again, the rest of the mine is going to collapse and take the entire bloody parade with it. That's quite alarming. Have you removed the activator? Ah, uh, no. The gang don't seem very interested in starting it up. I think you'd better let me remove the activator. I don't want any accidents. Ah, uh, all right. You'll need my keycard. I'll let them know you need relief. By God, you are the most on-the-ball person I've seen in years. Are you sure you're not a downer? Uh... <laughs> oh! <laughs> Again, Arthur's acting skills are very useful. <laughs> Hello there. I belong here. Oh, it's a canteen. Oh no. There's no way that I can go around this, right? Another joy, then. Sorry, Arthur. I'm that's really. Like a bug on a oh, drug. wow. Look at those. <sighs> Can I use this excavator thing to cross that abyss? I wonder how you turn it on. Oh, it's another memory, yes. Do not push the big lever, we'll destroy everything. How do you know if you've never pushed it? <laughs> okay. I don't know. Yes, a memory. I've got it! What if you come with me? And I'm too old. What if I sneak you on the train? That's against... That's against the rules. Oh, if we get caught, I'll just say there was a mix-up and you can play dumb. Are you sure? Remember how I snuck you on that camping trip? Didn't it work out brilliantly? Just trust me. I trust you, Arthur. I said... I trust you, Arthur. We'll go to Germany together. We'll take care of each other, no matter what happens. Okay, so yeah, it actually was... a mix-up. And Percy got on a train, although he was too old to go. I don't really know, do we really just have to blow up the parade now? Whatever. We need to get out of here. Sally is not a parade anyway. What? Where are we going? Ah, there we go. So... I wonder what is this thing doing? No, oh, we can't go anywhere there. Ah, okay. Oh no. Oh no. Hey there. What? Sorry. Oh, I guess everyone freaked because I'm a downer. Okay, everyone freaks because I'm a downer. No, I can't have this right now. I need to leave. Oh no. Okay, I'm out. This is it. This should be it, right? 
Oh, come on! Seriously? Can you just wait till I'm gone? Come oh on! We did it, right? We made it. We made it out. Yes. Yes. This is it. Are you really doing this to find Percy? I mean, where would you even look for him? Is he even alive? Is he in Russia? How would you even get to Germany? I have no idea. I have no idea what Arthur's plan is now. Oh good. I'm finally back on the right track. Huh. We did it. We made it out of Wellington Wells. Spain. You're doing this because you don't have a strong enough sense of self-preservation to leave Wellington Wells on your own account, aren't you? You need the guilt. Mm. I'm just, hmm. I wonder. I wonder if you would ever find Percy. I mean, this is... This is it. I guess. Oh, no. Mr. Hastings. <gasps> Just when I'd given up all hope of seeing an engineer. You know, sir, we've come to the end of our time. Some of us cut and run. Some of us stand by our post. Some of us take care of our brother. My brother? What are you saying? All men is brothers, sir. Right. Of course. Oh, damn thing so itchy. These times like these what try men's souls, sir. They try men's souls. I know oh, you. Please keep your hands inside the train. It is very dangerous to You must get back on the train. The windows Arthur, of the train. Where'd you go? Arthur! You must get back on board! No, I'm just here to take my brothers to the train. Mr. No, Percival Hastings. No. Is that me? Arthur, please, Percy? No, People no, call me Percy. Please, no. Someone has written on this card that you are a bit dim and you can't be roaming about on your own. You don't seem dim. Right, well, um, Mum thinks I can't... Mum no, thinks I can't... No, no, Mum no. thinks I can't no, take Arthur, care of myself. Arthur. But I can. To tell the truth, I really did want to go to Germany with my brother, Arthur. See, we, we'd sort of take care of each other. So I tried to sneak on, but then Arthur said, no, we have to follow the rules. Is that so? I'll just run along home. Mum's probably worried sick. Can I go? This is a day we may all come to regret, Mr. Hastings. But I am not going to put one more child on that train than my duty obligates me to do. Run along. No! 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 Sir, are you all right? I'll best be on my way. something terrible. Oh, we have all done things we regret, sir. Some of them we regretted as we done them. Some of them never quite go away. I told him we'd go to Germany together. I told him I'd hold our passports and then I walked off the train with his passport. He didn't 
didn't know how to talk to anyone but me. I can't make it up to him now. Can I? No, sir. I imagine you cannot. Then who is there to forgive me? Some try to forget. I can't do that. Not anymore. Well, I suppose you... You must treat it as a gift. To know who you are. Without that, there's no hope for wisdom. I wish I still believed in some sort of mercy. Life goes on. <laughs> that is the mercy. Come on, sir. Once you're out there, you'll know what to do. Wait a second, we're going to play Estelle now. Just is even better. This is getting better and better. Oh wow, what a finale. So, all my theories were wrong. Arthur isn't Percy, but he said that he was Percy to get off the train. He used Percy's passport and he acted as if he was Percy to get out. Oh no. <laughs> that is. Oh, such a sad story. I mean, this is getting even worse. But still, it's very moving, and I don't know. I, I, I have very little hope that Arthur would ever find Percy again. Also, I mean, I wouldn't know what what would Percy say. Would Percy have known that Arthur? lied to get off and to send him off to Germany. Would he be mad about this? Oh well, that was some hard stuff. Okay, so you're going to be Sally next. So this is gonna be a really long episode, but I think I want to go to... let's see how this begins and then we're gonna be Sally add three cc's well let's just fire this up please don't blow up in the next 30 seconds okay so we're Sally and, but, this is definitely uh, time to stop and we are going to continue Sally's story in the next episode. We finished, Ar we finished Arthur's story. We got Arthur out of Wellington Wells. So, Act 1 is closed. Let's see what Act 2 brings. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. And I will see you next time. Okay, or this is not the end because I cannot save while I'm in an interaction. Although I don't know what I'm interacting with, so I'll just answer the intercom now. And I hope that this will be the last thing we do for this episode. So where am I? Where do I even have to go? Okay. Just a minute! Where am I? Where are we? I'm out of Blackberry Spud. Come back later. I need it now. Sorry. I don't have any now. Okay. Um. So, was that it? I'm just gonna. No, we can't save her. Okay. 
So let's take a look around at Sally's office while we're at it. What the hell was that? <gasps> Where is it? Where's the Blackberry? I'm making it. You're lying. It's a very delicate reaction. You're saving it all for the bobbies. <laughs> Okay, so someone's robbing us. Can we save now, please? No, we can't. Oof. So where is our emergency kit? No, I need my emergency kit. Oh, here it is. But this better work on Spud. Sally uses knockout syringes to sneakily knock people out. It's so much more modern. Okay. Ah. Now I see. Oh no. Oh, so we finally get to look around in Sally's office. No. She broke my brain. It's not possible. We sent them all away. They never came back. It's a rat. What? I'm hallucinating and it's a rat and it's gonna bite me. You can't be a baby. You're a rat. You have to be a rat. We better get spot out of here. What? What? Sally has a You'd think a junkie child? would weigh a bit less, wouldn't you? Okay. Oh, Very man. interesting. Of course, there's the blower. Oof. What? What can we answer? Wait a second. Um. So wait, what's happening here? What's this? Brilliant. They all want Blackberry Joy. Spud couldn't have shown up at a worse time. So yeah, Sally is the one making Blackberry Joy. So... okay. Really? Can I not save now? No. This is going to be an episode of epic length. But I still, I want to read the notes. So, Spud dropped pie. Ta-da! I hope Gwen never remembers the look on his face, like she was all his anguish. I have to get Gwen out of here. We have to get the hell out of Wellington Wells. Those poor babies after the germs left. The breeder riots. Sooner or later, someone will make it upstairs and I will fail to put them down with an emergency kit in time. And then the doctors will come and I don't even want to think about the rest of it. Who can help us? Dr. V hates me with the fiery passion of his cold that hard. And I don't want to think what the quid would be for the general's quo. I wish Arthur and me were still the two musketeers, but when's the day I don't wish that? This morning I woke up and there she was, breathing so quiet and tiny and helpless, and I thought I could just squeeze her tight and keep squeezing and it wouldn't be long and she wouldn't cry anymore. I'm a horrible human being, mom's daughter that's sure, and I want everything in the world for her and she could be so much better than me so long as she's inherited her father's brains and not his heart. Pussycat, mind if I stop by for a cup of tea? I miss you so. Love, kitten. So, is this Sally's child? Or is it just someone else? It's this kid. I don't know. I hope Gwen's alright. So, the baby's name is Fuck Gwen. It, it. 
Oh great. What's wrong with your lab? Okay, no. Let's take care of Gwen first. is asleep. He won't bother you anymore. <laughs> oh, you've got a poopy nappy, don't you? Let's go get you a nice clean one. I'll need to filter some water. Holding your baby in your arms makes you feel like you're possibly not a rubbish mom, giving you a stamina and fatigue boost. Okay. So there is a little bit of chaos here breaking out. I still can't save. Um, I need to make some filtered water. Fill container. From ta oh, yeah, here's a canteen. Fill the canteen. Fill the water. Gwen's okay. running out of nappies. I better make some more. Why did I put that cloth and tape? Oh well. This is a babysitting simulator too. Um, okay, no. That's I shouldn't have left it alone. Turn off the alarm. I better turn first. down the heat. Oh yeah, I needed that anyway. Clientele. Blackberry. Bobby's top, top priority. Number nine. Leaf package and call box spot. Gemma, Gemma Olsen. She's taking Blackberry to Margaret Life and oh, she too. The celebrated Mr. K. Jimmy Watt. The Mad Haberdasher. Penny Snug. Sally Specials. Bingaling. Davy Hackney. The Design Center Kittens. Nick Lightbearer. Must pay cash. Madame Wanda. Vanessa Tinker Bell. On holiday. Sunshine. Prudence Holmes. Need to keep enough for me. Oblivion, one per customer, haha. <laughs> Prudence Holmes also was a um, client of Sally. Hmm. So, oh, I still haven't figured out what's wrong with my lab. Oh, this one. Who is it now? Hello, oh, Jesus there. Christ. Is there anyone in there? Okay, no. Curse the child. I want to save! Oh, God. Do you need a change again? Okay. Fine. Oh, stop ringing my bell. Okay, it's this one, right? What? Constable! Whatever brings you here? Someone seems to have bashed your front door in, Mom. Terrible, isn't it? I forgot my key and I had to sort of bash my way in. I've had reports, Mom. All sorts of people come into your door. Amazing, isn't it? So many people get lost these days and they keep asking me for directions. You're not selling illicit substances, are you? You mean aside from Blackberry Joy? To the constabulary? Oh. Are you Sally Boyle? Mm-hmm. Oh. That's stupid of me. I'm so sorry to have been a bother. I, I know a terribly good joiner. I'll send him round. Fix that door up for you. No need, Constable. But you're very sweet. I'll just, uh... I'll be on my way, Mom. Cheery bye. I hope Gwen's all right. Uh-huh. Whoa. Well, there's a lot going on in Sally's life, it seems. <laughs> Baby happy sounds. Oh, you can't be serious. I still can't save. Will I ever be able to save with Sally or is it always extra complicated like she said she was? No. I know, that's not fair. Hello! 
Miss Boyle, just wondering if you were uh, planning to, to, to drop by the, um, the, the, the old neighborhood anytime soon. We all miss you. Don't worry, I'm fine. I'm just in the middle of, um, cooking, no? I'll get on the blower and let everyone know. As soon as it's ready. Promise. Oh, she's probably hungry by now. I should have fed her before I started the reaction. Oh boy. I think Sally is a bit chaotic. No, 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 no. No, they can't all be broken. No, this was enough milk for a month. Fuck it, fuck it. I better go calm her down. I can't think when she's crying like that. There, there, baby. Everything's gonna be okay. Mummy promises. Thing is, Mummy doesn't know how she's gonna feed you. Did you know that? And if she doesn't figure it out, Baby is gonna starve to death. Is Mummy the worst Mummy ever? Yes, she is. Yes, she is. Lionel. Wait. Lionel might have tinned milk. He has a bit of everything. Oh boy. Hint, welcome to motherhood. At certain points in Sally's story, you will need to get back home and feed Gwen. Don't delay or an increasingly heavy burden will be placed upon you as you worry more and more about her. Okay. Listen, darling. Mummy's gonna go and see Lionel. Try not to cry too much till Mummy comes back. Okay? Please? Mummy will be back with supper as soon as she possibly can. Okay, will I be able to save now? Yes! Okay, so, this was it. Um, yeah. Quick addition to the last episode, which was already going on really long, and now it's getting even longer. So, once again, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next episode when we try to get some more milk for Sally's baby. See you!